Hey guys, welcome back to another video. We're gonna do Call of Duty of five things of why you are trash at Call of Duty. Let's start. One reason why you are trash at Call of Duty is your loadouts. I've seen a lot of newbie tons, like around my little brother. They have the exact same gun in two different loadouts. Why? I have no idea why. So, reason. A lot of people, they're only gonna have two loadouts. Unless if you get like level 60, I think, for level uh, loadout 3. But the main things I will get is a good AR. I think the AK-47 is a good one. Pimped out. Pimped out. Accessories, people. Accessories. A good um, thing. If you don't have this gun, you can get this gun. Loaded out. Plus, good um thingy, whatever these call. I forgot what they call them. Perks. Good uh, skins. I, I don't recommend wearing a backpack, but you do you. And then for this one, I either do a SMG or a sniper. So you pick one of those. You can funnel which type are you. More of a sniper, more of that. But make sure you have a a weapon for every single job. One for long range, one for medium range to short range. So that will very help you. In a lot of scenarios. Another reason why you suck at cop up do the it that you don't take your shots. Impressive. Don't go with the group because I'm trying to get some kills. Alright. Every time you don't take your shot is another kill you lose. Every time you do take a shot is another higher chance that you oh another way. Oh, this way. Another way. Uh, there's another person right here. Uh, blah, blah. Uh. Okay. So every time you don't shoot your shot, is another chance for them to shoot you back and then kill you. Every time you do shoot, is another chance of them not killing you and you getting a lot of kills. So. The human mind, it takes a certain time to respond to a certain thing. And that time you can use as your advantage. So the moment you go to over corner, always have your trigger finger ready. And this allows you to kill the enemy before they even respawn. And they pull the trigger. And this will help you out in so many scenarios. This my aim was just bad and that but in many other scenarios it will help you out a lot and it will just make you better at the game because the enemies will take longer that double kill they didn't even shot me once I think and that was pretty good so on to the next reason why you're bad at Call of Duty Another reason why you're very bad at Call of Duty is that you don't jump like, you just stand still like this. You, you just stand still like that. That what gets you killed, my man. Not what gets you killed. Here's what you should do. Oh, enemy. You move around. You start strafing. But then that time I got double killed. So let's excuse this time. So, uh, you start sliding now. Oh, look, enemy. Oh, enemy. Enemy. Sliding, sliding. Okay, now you reload. You turn around and you make sure... That your surrounding is good. Double kill right there. Look, you see the so Double kill. But always make sure that... Oh, enemy. Move around as much as possible. The more you move, the more kills. The more kills, the more you die. The more you die, the more experience you get in playing Call of Duty. You learn from your mistakes, kids. Like that guy. He didn't move. Like me. I didn't move. Another reason why you suck at Call of Duty is that you don't know your maps. If you don't know your maps, you don't know where to go. If you don't know where to go, you don't know how to kill the people. You don't know how to kill the people, you're trash kid. Trash kid. Oh, learning the map, it will make you travel from point A all the way to point B. 
to point B, which is your enemies in this case. Bruh, my aim was potato. If I hit my shots, move around, and all the maps, you, you do your math too, and make sure you don't die, you'll get better at the game. Another reason why you're bad at Call of Duty is you don't have your sound on. For not having the sound on, you lose a lot of important things. For example, like knowing where the enemy is. If the enemy is walking through the house, you should be able to hear it. And you see the announcer that's and you see the announcer that's saying lost the lead, uh, quite harder and stuff. Yeah, you should pay attention to him. The reason why is you can know if there's a UAV um that's like where the enemy knows where you at and they could and you know that there's a certain weapon that helps you take down that or you can just shoot it down from behind us. But that what that allows us to do is you can get ready to make your next plan. Another kill. I'm gonna help you out, buddy. So yeah, guys. So thank you for watching, and please like and subscribe. And hope you are taking consideration my tricks for Call of Duty. And I should. I'm gonna do more of these. But yeah, guys. Uh, peace out and have a good one.